girl joy back with another banger yes i am in my car and i'm not trying to play with y'all i'm not playing with y'all sister's hungry got me some new light well it's not new you guys have seen the videos my first time using it i did not make up my bed um i left school later than i wanted to leave so i have some new year's resolutions not resolutions but goals for the new year so what i'm about to do i can't play with y'all right now i really can't i need to eat oh my god it's 10 27 god dang time has flown by i don't know how i'm still awake i can operate on a little bit of sleep but eventually it does catch up with me so i got back from arkansas and i arrived late 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 because there was drama on deck i don't even think i have the energy to go through that right now okay. i went to the store i'm about to make me a steak i'm about to season my steak i got a steak eggs and spinach and some tomato okay so that's gonna be my dinner it is late and then i'm gonna watch i, I have stuff to do i'm just gonna have to make it to school extra early but then i have something at the cleanest that i hope that's done but I'm about to hook the steak up because it's been at room temperature. I wanted to, to get the room temperature. So this is me on my new, I've been following this guy, Eddie, and I've shared his page or his Instagram page on a previous video. And it just makes sense. And I used to eat this way before and just for fear of feeling tired and so on and so forth, I'm going back to that. So for snack, Oh well, I got me some ghee butter and I'm upset that I left my ghee in Arkansas with Bobby. I was like, Joy, don't forget it. So it's a high fat diet. Um, it's a misconception that is gonna cause cholesterol. I have another friend who started eating this way and she has branched out with the fasting and all that stuff. I got me some Himalayan pink salt. I have some high fat nuts. And this was a little pricey to get all the nuts I wanted. Roasted pecans or pecans, however you want to say it, okay? Whatever floats your boat, okay? Tomatoes, tomatoes, macadamia nuts. And then I was looking for things that had one to two to three ingredients, no more. And I think something fell. So I have pecans, I have walnuts. Something fell, y'all. Got me some paper towels got my steak i'm just hungry at this point i don't care i got some tea so i'm operating on about three and a half hours of sleep spinach tomatoes what's this oh my eggs these are cage-free eggs so bobby put me on to the cage-free eggs a little hot sauce okay just in case i need hot sauce so i'm gonna get this going i'm gonna season my steak and i'm gonna get that going clean out the pot and then scramble up the eggs real quick and so we can get this meal going honey okay because sister hungry I, oh i want to fight somebody so i was a little hesitant and then i have my bag of her hair 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 bag of hair and I I know I pulled down an extension cord I don't know what that extension cord is it's not like it's that much room in here where I'm just gonna be losing stuff but baby I did not go to storage I didn't make it to storage I had clothes in a car so kids where's the extension cord kids didn't come back to school today they come back with my eggs. I don't want to mess up my eggs. The kids come back tomorrow. I ain't make up my bed, nothing. And the girls, you know, I don't know if you saw that video. Go back and watch the Christmas video. They bought me a heated blanket. So when I arrived, it was a little cold. The cold is different in Texas than it is in Arkansas. It's a different kind of cold. It's just different, y'all. So let's see. Roasted pecans. No, I pulled on an extension cord. I know I'm not going crazy. I know I'm not, y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm-mm-mm. 
I'm hungry. Let me get the steak on. I'm gonna keep it simple. I don't think I have any size on. Mm. But Himalayan pink salt is supposed to be good for you. Tea. I have a tea kettle in here that works by um, USB. I don't got no cup. I left my cup at school. That's all right. I don't need that because it'll keep me up. So I'll just take this with me tomorrow. Oh, let me try these macadamia nuts. I haven't had those in a long time. What? Himalayan. This one, it says Hawaiian sea salt. These are high fat foods. High in fat. Good fat. So I was a little scared today. I was going to go out and just get some eggs and scramble up some eggs, some olives, some spinach. I'll eat that. But happened today it's like the whole day just ran away from me and i don't do too well if there are a whole bunch of people around me i i can't get in my creative zone then i had meetings the internet was down it was a lot going on before i run out of space let me get this steak going i just want to eat y'all and so the ghee butter I don't know if you heard of ghee. This is clarified butter. There's a way you can make your own. And it has a high burn rate, so it doesn't really smoke. And this is um, a good fat. And one ingredient. Organic clarified butter or milk. That's it. That's it. So I'm not here to try to convince you guys how to eat and lifestyle. You have to do what's best for you. Because I know some people get on this kick where they're, 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 they're changing their eating habits and lifestyle. They didn't want to preach to everybody. Mm -mm. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. You got to do what's best for you. And when the spirit hits you. I mean, I've known about this stuff. But I had to do it when I was ready. You can't tell me when to do it. And then, you know, a lot of people want to say, oh, preach to you this, preach that. Like, bro, you just started. <laughs> so I meant, huh, open this, y'all. Ooh. See, so I'm just going to put a little bit of seasoning on the steak, fry it in, my clarified butter. And you don't have to refrigerate this. And I know one of my friends that I remember when she started down this health journey, she was frying stuff in duck fat and this and that. Baby, all you see, and she works out too. All you see now are muscles. She used to be a bigger girl, cut up. So I want to put this hair up. Put this hair up, season my steak, and get my steak going. So I will be right back so I'm not running out of space. Period. I'm looking for a movie. And it's raining. I love when it's raining and I'm in a car. I just love it. Equalizer 3, baby. Let me tell you, I don't need no sleep. I don't need no sleep. None. Oh, and the extension cord does not work. I love me some Denzel, honey. Love me Denzel, okay? And I watch Equalizer 1 and 2. Brother is bad and is. I'm going to season my steak. Put on my movie. I'm going to put on my movie while I season my steak. And then I'll stop frying it. So I don't want to turn this on yet. Because I will say this pot is called Bear. I freaking love her. It's an electric pot. Love, love, love her. Stuff doesn't stick to her. Nothing. You can wipe it out with a little vinegar and water. Um, I've washed her but not submerged her. She wasn't submerged in water because, you know, you got your cord right there. But she's phenomenal. <sighs> and I didn't have everything balanced, so all my seasonings fell on the floor. On the floor. All right. So let me start my movie and I'll season my steak so I can get that going. I like to put gloves on since I am. I wash my hands when I got in the car. But since I'm in a car, I like to wear gloves. 
And for those who are like, oh, your car price sink. I don't cook in a car very often. I will say that I don't. Um, but I'm going to start doing it more. So I use a splash card. And I also use this right here. And it's really awesome. But for some reason, it stops spraying. So it won't spray. So I like to spray my car. But I, I do not cook in here very often. Mm -mm. Seasoning. I don't know where to know though. I'm gonna do a light season because that's how hungry I am. Wait, let me start my movie, y'all. Okay. Open up my steak. Right. Ooh, so this is a T-bone steak. And this particular steak was almost $15. Sister is hungry. I only ate once today. And I fasted until around 1 o'clock. And that's when I had my first meal. But it wasn't the meal that I wanted to have. And I was a little afraid that it was going to make me feel tired. It's something about breads and carbs and stuff. It makes me sleepy. Even when I was driving back from Arkansas back to Texas, I didn't want any carbs. I was, a, I was terrified. You hear me? Terrified. And it's almost like with school, I'm going to uh, take my life back. So I would literally leave school working, working. Sometimes I'll eat, take a break to eat. Trying not to spread this everywhere. And I got onion powder, garlic powder. And then I'll massage that in. I still want my joint flavorful, okay. And I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not doing it anymore. Mm -mm. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my life back. I'm going to take my life back and I'm going to invest in my, you know, my social media. Because like I was saying, this is a little bit of, um, and a lot of people don't have to do this. This is accent. I, I have to be in a mood for it. I'm going to massage that in. And I'm going to put the same seasons on the other side. So what I am going to do, I know. I took out some cayenne pepper. Ever since I had COVID a couple of years ago, um, I like a little heat on my food. I like a little bit of heat. I do. A little bit of adobo. Onion pop. And I love, 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 love onions. And I do not. I didn't feel like cutting no onions up in here. So she good. She good and I'm gonna massage her in. Massage the seasoning in. And then I'm gonna put some, turn on my pot, and I'm gonna put some ghee in there and fry her up. I should do a fried egg, but sometimes, no, I want a scrambled egg. So I'm gonna put all my seasonings away and I'll just use a little bit of Himalayan salt on the eggs because as you see, I really seasoned up my steak. So we don't need to go overboard. You feel me? You feel me? But usually when I make eggs, I I add a little adobo. A little adobo. But baby, let me tell you, I made some boiled eggs. And baby, I'm, so I'm not going to put it away. So put the lids on everything. I added some low sodium bouillon powder it was everything everything i don't know if y'all add bouillon powder to your eggs but i did and i was blown away blown away so i don't need the onion powder i don't need the garlic powder anymore so i'm putting those in i have a seasoning drawer <laughs> and i think i showed it in one video i don't know so now I'm about to turn my pan on. Okay, let me, just in case, have my towel. Dump it in my little. Okay, just in case. But I'm gonna vacuum this stuff really well tomorrow. So, okay, I just turned my pan on, my pot. I turn it on high and she heats up pretty fast and I have my splatter screen I'm gonna open up my ghee I'm gonna wait till she heats up first 
And she's fast. Everything's fast, fast. And so, I was supposed to go to the gym today. It's like being back at work after being gone for a long period of time. And then the internet wasn't working across the entire... I don't know. I think it was... Um, some type of line was cut by construction people and everybody's internet was down so we weren't able to do as much as we wanted to so this is our ghee and this that should be good remember this is this is good fat so it's a high fat it's almost like so this diet is almost like but i ain't counting nobody's calories i'm not doing that you gotta watch this guy so I'm pretty sold on this guy. Did I turn the US? Did I turn this on? Oh, there she is. Child, she wasn't even turned on. So, and I just, he's just so real. I, I just like him. And sometimes it takes that person, that one person to spark that interest in you. And he did it. And I used to eat this way. Child, you couldn't get me to eat a carb. Mm -mm. You could not. <coughs> so I'm melting my butter. My ghee, ghee ghee, and the ghee is um, a little pricey, but um, I feel like it's healthier. And I'm scrambling up some eggs. I hope I can eat all this. <coughs> I'm hungry, and I can actually function on a little bit of sleep. Oddly, I can. It's weird, and so it's almost. Oh my gosh, I'm hungry. At this point, I don't even care. Only thing I had today <coughs> was about a cup of black eyed peas. And baby, let me tell you, those black eyed peas were good. And talk about the flavor. Mm. The flavor on those black eyed peas make you slap your mama. So I had one of my coworkers try them. And I was like, go ahead, get another spoonful. Whatever. Right? And she was like, oh my God, these are, I said, that flavor is hitting, right? She was like, yeah. And so I brought a whole bunch back from Arkansas thinking my friend Mary, I parked in front of Mary's house, thinking she was going to, she was like, oh, oh, oh no, I don't eat that. So I brought back extra black eyed peas. So, and I brought them back. They were frozen and I had ice packs on them. So, okay, so now I'm going to put my steak. You hear that? Yeah, that sizzle. So I'm gonna be a greedy toad tonight, honey. Cause I do not have no freezer packs or whatever I don't eat. Okay. So I'm like, do I need the, I don't think I'll need the gloves again. And see, I just like, you take them off your hands and still clean, okay? That's how you do it, that's how you do it. So I didn't use this one, so I'm gonna put this one to the side just in case. So I've got my little trash bag going. And so when I leave and get out in the morning, so I'll be going to the gym in the morning. Ooh, let me put my splatter screen. People are like, oh, I bet your car stink. No, it doesn't. <laughs> so my steak is cooking. I probably, since it's so late, I don't know, guys. I'm Well, I got the eggs and I didn't bring any freezer blocks <gasps> Ooh, one broke <sighs> so eventually i'll see how i feel eventually i will get a refrigerator but at this point i don't really need it not at this moment and then i'm working on some new things for 2024 i am so excited about 2024 i have never been this pumped up about any year ever I'm just excited about the new things to come. And I always say, and I wholeheartedly believe this. I don't know, whatever your religious beliefs are, maybe you don't have any, and that's your business. That is your business. No judgment here. Um, I believe, for me, that when your life is made to feel so uncomfortable or unhappy, that it's God's way of forcing you to change. And I feel a change coming on. And so I am encouraged. I am 
excited. And sometimes just like, I don't know any other example to give you, but just like if you are in a relationship and you're not sure if that relationship is good or if it's the right thing for you, just not sure it's that gray area. But then you're like, well, it's just, I don't know. It's not bad. And then that one thing happens to wake you up. And then you're ready for the change. So I think certain things fell into place to wake me up. And then, and I love, and it just, it just fills my heart when you have certain people who believe in you more than you believe in yourself. And then there have been certain people and be like, oh, you're so creative. I've never met anyone as creative as, as you and blah, blah, blah. And just live your dreams. And, and there's something bigger out there for you. Because if it's just teaching, it's, it's just not teaching. It's something bigger. I don't know what it is at my old age. I'm like, what? The casket? <laughs> for the big, big party? The goodbye party? <laughs> So while I'm still here, I'm going to still pursue some of my dreams. And um, many of you already know, and sometimes I sound like a broken record, but you're not gonna get you're not gonna get my energy up there, okay? Not, and you won't. But I've always wanted to try RV living. I never, the plan was never car living, but this car is huge. Um, it was never that was never the plan, but I wanted to see how I liked it first. And like I've said before, for new people, people forgot or sped through a video, um, I wanted to try car living before I invested into an RV. And it's not bad. And, and also, once something becomes a habit, it's part of your regular routine. And I will say, with this pot, if you're on the battery, it does pull a lot from your battery. So that's why I said, mm, I gotta wait. <laughs> I'm ready to turn this on. And I did not crack my windows. I did not crack my windows this time. It's raining. And then what I do, I heat up the car um, before I crawl to the back. And I have, a, I have a heated blanket that the girls, that my daughters bought me for, oh, I'm gonna put my little socks on though. That my daughters, a student, a student gave me these that my daughters bought me for Christmas and I haven't needed it. And then sometimes when it's nice and cool, you be cozy, cozy. So I haven't needed it yet. So I just put my little sockies on. So I am so psyched about 24. Um, I'm using one of the calendars that I bought for my daughter because she had an extra one so I started working on that to work on my vision board but my vision board I'll be sharing that with you guys my vision board is not on a board it's going to be my uh, screen saver is it my screen saver my wallpaper it's going to be my wallpaper on my phone so I was going through the steps of creating and I wanted to share that with you because how many times you look at your phone everybody keeps their phone with them everybody don't walk around with a vision board a board a physical board but that phone baby you keep that phone with you she cooking y'all she cooking so I'm going to get back to you I'm gonna let her cook and then I will scramble my eggs and I'll put spinach oh yeah I got spinach did I show you this already I got spinach oh, these tomatoes are good so these are all washed so I did that so I want to cut these in half and then throw them in my scrambled eggs. So you don't see not one carb. Will you see a carb? Will you see a rice? Will you see a bread? Will you see some sugar? Nowhere. And if you ever make steak, I know some people don't eat steak. If you don't eat steak, that's your business. But if you eat steak, you want to make your steak, you want to bring it to room temperature first um, before you cook your steak. So let me get this going and let me turn on some Denzel, honey. You know I can rock with a Denzel, okay? Okay. <laughs> and so, and then we will eat together. Yes, I was so excited. I haven't been this excited to eat. And I tell you, my goal, one of my goals for 24 is to not give the school all my time. 
because I feel as though all my time and the extra that I put in is not appreciated. It's never given back to me. And I'm not doing it anymore. It's like I'm I'm going to rec I'm going to reclaim my life and put it put energy into other things that's going to help me work on some of my goals for 24. I know here and there some days I'll stay, I'll have to stay late because it's just who I am. Today I stayed late and then I went to the grocery store to finish up um, a vision that I had in my head. So I had to get that out of my head to try to prepare for when, it's, when the students come back. So I'm thinking that I can maybe gonna turn this steak over. Let's turn her over. I don't like to flip steak too much. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, put this splatter screen back on. Ooh. And also when you get steak or any meat, you wanna get a steak that has a lot of marble. And what that means is you wanna get steak that has a lot of white spots. And that means you're gonna get more flavor in that steak. And you know, with my new eating goal and that splatter screen it works. So mm -mm, you keep that over there. Keep that over there. Keep that over there. All those little splatters. Just splat mm -mm. So you want to get high, um, a lot of marble in your steak. And this is treat. I've been wanting another steak since my birthday celebration. Remember? I spent my birthday on the beach and then I got stuck on the beach. Baby, if it's not one thing, it's another. But I know we need to kind of address the elephant in the room real quick. You hear that fry? It's the frying. It's the rain. Let me tell you, the setting is everything, honey. Everything. And, and Am I upset? Am I sad? No. Are my kids upset? Sad? No. They're going about their business. Sydney's traveling. She was in Houston. Then she traveled to Dallas. Then she's traveling to Atlanta. I don't know. I don't know the quite the full route. Then she's going to Atlanta. Then I think she's flying to Dallas. I can't keep up. I can't keep up. I, I can't. I'm I don't know. Maybe I'm just too old. I can't keep up. Live your life. Live your life, boo. I'll be there when you need me. Live your life. My mother wasn't a helicopter mother. Mm-mm. She wasn't a helicopter. Um, I'm glad she wasn't, so that's why I'm I'm a free spirited person. Do I wish certain things were different? Um, yeah, but it has made me who I am today. Um, a lot of you may think it's a hot mess, and that's your business. But my children love me, and that's all that matters. Right? So, I'm going to call you back later. Oh, the elephant in the room. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I did. And I did what? Shave it off. What? Gone. And I don't see a little challenging when that gray hair start coming in. When that gray hair. Oh well. It is what it is. But I like it. It makes you so clean. And I'm still working on the back. I got this bottom row done. But I gotta work on this this part. And I did. And then I was trying to curly pieces. A so little something new for 24. A little something, something. A little something, something. <laughs> I'm going to call you back. I'm going to call you back. Look how things pop up on your memory. Look at this. Look at this. That's Sydney. You got Bob. Ooh. Bobby. Oh God, it's going fast, y'all. That's Sydney. That's us in New York. Sydney girl. That's us. Look how cute. And these are memories that just popped up. Look at that. That was a nice treat. That was a nice treat. Wanted to share that with you. So, you know, I was trying to get back to the equalizer. Okay. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I gotta go to the bathroom. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh, look, I don't want to overcook my steak. But it was at room temperature, so it should be good. So maybe I just let her rest a little bit. Ooh, chap. Ooh, I got to do You don't have an answer, Claire. Look, I need to just go pee. <laughs> no, Siri. No. 